Hello, this is Liz Bears with the Okaloosa County School District Department of Instructional Technology. And today, I'm going to show you how to set up your clear touch panel in three easy steps. To get started, let's turn the panel on. The first thing you'll want to do is make sure you have the master power switch turned on. And that's located underneath on the back side about where the cable goes in. There's a little toggle switch back here. and Just make sure that's turned on and it's plugged in. The second thing you'll want to do is push the button. Many devices have the on switch in the front and the bottom right corner. This particular one has it on the side. Let's give it a moment to boot up. We'll start with connecting the device to Wi-Fi. Look at the bottom left side of the screen for this little wave symbol. This one has an X on it showing that it's not connected to Wi-Fi. We'll tap the Wi-Fi button and then looking up here it says use Wi-Fi. We need to toggle this switch on. Now that we've toggled it on, we're going to look for UNET and we're going to tap on UNET to have it go to UNET. Look at the display and let's check the information. The EAP method should read PEAP and it does. Phase 2 authentication should say MSCHAPV2 and it does. And then the CA certificate, this one says use system certificates. What it should say is do not validate or do not use on first. So since it says the wrong thing, I'm going to tap the message and I'm going to select do not validate. Now it's correct. Where it says identity, I'm going to put in my username, the same username that's the front part of my email address. So for me, it's Bears E. I'm going to skip the part that says anonymous identity and I'm going to enter my current password that I use to sign in on my machine. And then over here, over here I can touch the connect button. Now it's connecting to UNET. Let's give it a few minutes to finish setting up. Now we've connected it to Wi-Fi. This is what you should see. The word connected it may not show up this way at first, so you'll just have to give it some time until it does. When it says connected, you'll go ahead and do the back arrow. This brings us back to our home screen, and now when you look at the Wi-Fi symbol, you'll see that it's just a regular Wi-Fi symbol. No exclamation points, no X's, nothing like that. Now we're ready for step number two. Step, step number two is enrolling this device in the command module. To do that, we'll tap the waffle at the bottom right. We'll choose the icon here that says Command. And we're going to enroll the device. It will say Organization Code and we'll put in 321178. That number is on the handout that's been sent to you. Your admin account is an email address, cleartouch at okaloosaschools.com. The device name is going to have a long name on it. We're going to want to erase that name and enter a different one. Now this is important to enter the name of your school with about four letters. So I'm at Carver Hill. I'm going to do C-V-R-H. There's Carver Hill. And now I'm going to put a dash in there and I'm going to give the name of the room that the device is going to be located in. This is the tech lab, so I'll use TL. Device tag, you'll want to say whether it is a classroom or a cafeteria or some other type of office. Finally, I need to agree to the user agreement and click enroll. That's step number two. I've enrolled my device. The pop-up will show up showing four buttons, five buttons that are turned on. We don't need to make any changes. We'll touch the X to close the pop-up. And there it is. Name of the device, the type of device, 
and the admin account. Great work, everybody. Now my device is both connected to Wi-Fi and enrolled in the command center. Step number three is to contact the ClearTouch admin to let them know that I have enrolled the device. That email address is cleartouch at okaloosaschools.com. It's very important that I let them know that I've enrolled the device so they can push out updates as needed. Thank you for watching. This has been How to Set Up Your ClearTouch Panel in Okaloosa Schools.